Hello friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial series I'll be showing you how you can design a hammer in KCIV5. There are two parts mainly. I have uh, put a head and the handle. So I've just named that in uh, very simple terms. And uh, the detailing is here, somewhat over here. And uh, some detailing is here and there is another detailing which is uh, very similar to the screwdriver which we have worked before here so let's see how we can start off with the design firstly go to new and open a new product click on ok and you could firstly name the product as we always do that's the hammer study ok click on OK and the, the name got changed to hammer study here and then go for insert new part and click on the product and you got a new part there and again rename that part as head right now just double click on the part body and the workbench changes to the most previously used the most recently used uh, workbench which is this one the part design and if it's not you could go here and change it to the part design which that's the workbench which we are going to work now the first thing you need to do is set up the units so in this tutorial i'm going to work on uh, centimeters so make sure that's in the centimeters and click on ok and then you can first create a base sketch seriously you could go here on the explain and click on the sketch and use a central rectangle and create a rectangle there probably a square and you could uh, set the 2.5 centimeter here and another 2.5 here I guess that's really close 2.5 alright now once that's done click on the exit sketch and then go for a pad of reverse direction make sure your render style is in perspective mode now the parallel mode go for 5.5 that creates a dumb solid and uh, I hope you can imagine which part would be appearing for this one so let's see how we can continue with the design and if you have any doubt on this particular part just come below the video and I'll be getting in touch with you and uh, any doubts or if you want me to create tutorials on any particular topic you could uh, write to me at ktr.proto.user at gmail.com that's all for this particular part stay tuned